Here we are smoking on a Sunday again. Today, Monday, in celebration of Memorial Day, we are gonna do Korean skirt steak tacos. So, a couple of things. Uh, we have all of our ingredients out. We made this really nice marinade oh, here. Oh, and hi. Oh, and this is Chase. He's gonna, he helped me today. Bunch of different things in here. Everything from rice vinegar, to sesame oil, to sherry, to soy sauce, to garlic, minced garlic, to kiwi, to, to lime, and chives, and as I think I mentioned, minced garlic. So this is what we're gonna use for the marinade. The other secret that we have today is you'll notice nice skirt steak, but you'll notice the diagonal patterns that we've put into the steak, about an eighth of an inch deep, and this allows for a really, really good marinade. So what you wanna do here is you wanna get the skirt steak in a plastic bag or a deep dish, something where you can get all the marinade on top of it. And what we're gonna do is we're just gonna simply put the marinade right on top of the steak. I'm trying to make sure it has just enough where it can sit on the top and on the bottom. We'll go ahead and massage that in for a little bit and let it sit in the, out, in the refrigerator for about an hour, maybe two hours to give it a really nice time to marinate. What you'll notice right now is the steak is still reddish in color and as it marinates, it'll turn a little grayish in color. All right, we'll catch you on the other side of the marinade. Here we are about an hour into the marinating process. Just checking on these bad boys again. What we want to do about halfway through, give them a really nice flip. Now what you'll notice is that as you give them this flip, You'll notice how the color is now changing a little bit. It's a little bit darker, a little bit grayer. That means the marinade's doing its job. Okay, here we are. Post-marinade, because I've been here for a couple of hours. Nice penetration of the marinade. Got a nice color on both sides. Notice how those slats that we cut earlier are actually really penetrating the marinade. Also have some skewers here we're going to do, some sides. Okay, here we are. The vegetables have been grilling for about 10 minutes or so, trying to get those nice and done. We're gonna move these guys around a little bit and get these steaks on. Okay, we got those steaks on, put them right in the middle. Only need about three minutes per side until they got a nice sizzle going. Okay, we just gave the steaks a flip. And as you can tell, the slats that we put into each one of the steaks, you see how they're opening up and really letting that steam and the heat and the fire get in, as well as all the flavor. And when you get it all done, this is exactly what it looks like. Oh, look at those juices. You can see the juices coming out of the steak. You can see the steak is marinated very, very well. You see the inside of the steaks are just about medium rare, a little bit on the rare sides on some pieces. Nice crisp on the outside. This is gonna be delightful. Got a bunch of other seasonings here and our taco shells. Off we go.